Hundreds of companies brought several thousand robots and technological gadgets to Las Vegas for the world's largest innovation show, CES 2023. This truly legendary exhibition of consumer electronics and robotics allows you to look into the future decades ahead. We have prepared for you the most interesting novelties from the world of robotics and high-tech in one video to give you the most complete overview of the technologies of the near future. Watch this video until the end, there will be a lot of unusual and interesting things. You're on the Caro Show channel, let's start. At CES 2023, a lot of robots and unusual gadgets were presented. Looking at many projects that were presented at the exhibition, it is hard to believe that technologies of this level already exist. But this is a reality that has already arrived, and we will begin our dive into the world of future technology with the AEO robot by Aeolus Robotics, which was one of the many highlights of the exhibition. The humanoid robot is positioned as a delivery man, disinfector, as well as a robotic companion and caregiver for the elderly. AEO can perform different tasks with different hands. So one arm can be equipped with a UV panel, and the other with a grip for opening doors, carrying things, controlling the elevator and appliances. The robot's vision and intelligence allow it to determine if a patient has fallen and needs medical attention. These abilities also make it a security guard capable of checking windows and doors, unauthorized people, and forgotten bags in hospitals, schools, and other institutions. To enhance the security features, the AEO is equipped with a 360-degree night vision camera. It uses real-time streaming video and two-way voice communication to alert security services if something happens. It is reported that the robot is already in use in Japan, Hong Kong, and Taipei by commercial property owners and elderly care companies. A few years ago, the robot already appeared at CES, but then it was positioned as a home assistant and butler. It wiped the floor with a mop and brought the owner a beer from the fridge. It is a pity that this version of the robot was not presented at the 2023 exhibition. American startup Aska brought its A5 flying car to CES, and it is not a prototype. It is a finished and tested vehicle, which should be tested by the U.S. Federal Aviation Administration within the next month. A four-seat electric vehicle can cover up to 250 miles or about 400 kilometers on a single battery charge. The developers say that the Aska with folded wings fits in a regular parking space. The vertical takeoff and landing machine is already available for pre-order for just under $800,000. It is expected that by 2026, it will be widely used in many taxi fleets in major cities. ADT Commercial unveiled EvoGuard robotic security systems at CES 2023, including humanoid robots that will act as security guards. EvoGuard will use artificial intelligence and augmented reality, combined with a fleet of autonomous humanoid robots and drones, to comprehensively monitor security in various commercial applications. The solution aims to launch later this year and will offer customers 24-hour patrols, two-way communication, intruder photography, elevator and door control, some fine motor tasks, and quick alerts to special services. The robot can also be controlled in avatar mode with a virtual reality system. This feature creates a telepresence effect in which the human controller can interact with the real environment through the robot. The cutest robot pet at the show was K. Luna. The robot has attractive large eyes and wiggle ears. He is smart enough to move around living spaces on his own without collision. The body design is primitive, but still it is an incredibly cute robot. He can recognize faces, body movements, objects, gestures, people's voices, as well as emotions. If Luna sees that the owner is sad, he will try his best to cheer him up. The robot feels great in space, does not crash into various objects, and also does not fall from stairs or furniture. Luna, like a real pet, is able to show emotions, sneeze, scratch, play with various objects, as well as repeating words to his master. At CES 2023, there were more colorful car concepts than never before. BMW presented a new concept car from the iVision D series, which stands for Digital Emotional Experience. The car is equipped with a mixed reality projection display, which occupies the entire area of the windshield 
and is the central control. Located on the front panel, touch sensors with Shytech technology allow the driver to set four different levels of digital content displayed on the display. The first includes important driving information, to which is added the content of the communication system, then augmented reality projections, and finally the exit to the fully virtual world. However, car owners will be able to enjoy VR while driving only after BM introduces level 5 of autonomy. But that's not all. The car supports voice control and responds to the owner, as well as communicating with him in various ways. For example, it can use a personalized greeting combining graphic elements, light and sound effects. Arnold Schwarzenegger is not involved in the promo video for nothing. He is here to proclaim the friendship of smart cars and people. Even the headlight and bumper grill can be adjusted to display different facial expressions to suit your mood. And the BMW iVision D concept also knows how to change the color of the body. The technology provides several layers of the thinnest electrochromic film on the body. The entire surface of the car is divided into 240 segments, including even the wheel rims. Each can be controlled individually. There is a choice of 32 colors from black to white. But this is still a conceptual technology. But a display instead of a windshield will be put into production for the company's cars already in 2025. Cars of the future need chargers of the future. Evar has just such a solution. An autonomous EV charging robot named Parky delivers a charging station to any parking lot. In doing so, to use Parky, drivers must find a spot near the EV robot's jack and plug it in. You can then use NFC to call the Parky and it will automatically find your car. The robot provides 15 kilowatts per hour of DC charging, which will give it a range of 50 miles. Sony together with Honda created and presented at CES its first electric car under the Afila brand, with sales starting in 2026. The lineup will consist of a crossover, sedan, and minivan, but only the sedan was shown at the show. There are 45 safety sensors installed in the car, including cameras that monitor the road situation. And the display located between the headlights allows you to display various information and thus communicate with the owner and others. Technical details have not yet been disclosed. For hardware power will be responsible chips Qualcomm, which will provide smart functions and multimedia car. In the final version of Afila, Honda will be responsible for the driving qualities of the model, and Sony will take over the electronics, including the system of autonomous driving. Which concept car do you think is the coolest? Write your opinion in the comments, and we are moving on. Rick Tech Robotics brought their traditional for such events Adam Robot, which can professionally prepare coffee or any tea drink, even tea with milk or passion fruit. It is enough to select a drink on the digital display, and the robot will start making it while dancing and entertaining the exhibition visitors around. At CES 2023, there were also a lot of Robopets and pet robots. One of the cutest is the Dog A from Wowie. The robot puppy with facial tracking technology can make eye contact with a loving gaze and respond to touches on his head. It also has lights on its paws, tail, and chest. A system of built-in sensors, microphones, and speakers allows him to hear and respond to commands. The developers say the robot has more than 200 sounds and reactions. You can customize a unique character for Doggy in the app. You can also train it to remember its name and perform tricks. And all members of the family in the Robopass's profile and the puppy will be for everyone what he wants. It remains to say that the robot has a great price of $80 and will start arriving to the first buyers this year. Elephant Robotics presented at CES its robot pet Medicat which looks like it will shoot lasers out of your eyes if you suddenly do something wrong. Would you like to have one of these cute things in your house? Guess which new product resonated most with journalists and CES attendees? You'll never guess. It's Withings U-Scan, a gadget designed for people to defecate on. Withings U-Scan is a urine analyzer, which is mounted inside the toilet and analyzes the incoming material. Based on the results, it will give its judgment on nutrition, identify dehydration of the body, ovulation cycle, assess metabolic and vitamin C levels. All results are sent via Wi-Fi to your smartphone. The device will run 100 tests, after which you need to replace the cartridge and recharge the gadget. 
It would seem that all, no more tedious trips to the doctors, but they are just the ones who sound the alarm. Unnamed specialists, according to media reports, are worried about the accuracy of tests and their correct interpretation by a person. But in any case, this is the first step to the dream of many, when you can come up in the morning to the mirror and get full information about the state of your body. An ingeniously simple and useful gadget was presented by South Korean startup 10 Minds. It is a pillow with a built-in microphone that detects snoring, distinguishing it from other extraneous sounds. The gadget then silently changes its shape and size so that it gently turns the sleeper's head into a position that allows them to breathe peacefully. The pillow, which syncs with a smartphone app, also collects data that is analyzed to identify snoring patterns so it can hone its response over time. L'Oreal presented a couple of beauty gadgets at CES. The first one was Brow Magic, a printer for drawing eyebrows, which will soon go on sale. The essence of the technology is to choose the shape, thickness, and effects for the eyebrows in the branded app for the smartphone. Then the result can be tried on with the help of augmented reality, and only after making sure that it fits the face. Unlike tattooing, printed eyebrows can be erased. The company's second interesting gadget was the L'Oreal Hapta, a portable lipstick applicator to help people with neurological problems. It is a reliable grip and stabilization device that allows a person with limited mobility to apply lipstick independently. The company is going to refine the gadget and launch it on the market for $150 to $200. Which of the robots did you like the most? Write your opinion in the comments. Don't forget to hit on the like button if you enjoyed this video and subscribe to the Caro Show channel. See you next time.